Hey guys, Gibby with Fire Bros. Today we're going to go over step-by-step -step instructions how to use a spot weld cutter and spot weld splitters. Um, got this kit up for 22 bucks off of Amazon. Comes with a spring-loaded spot weld cutter. Um, has five extra cutters and you can use both sides. So each cutter counts as two. Um, also comes with a spot weld drill bit. So we're going to go over step-by-step -step how to use it. You have two, two drills. Works best because we're going to put up little pilot and I'll show you why and spot weld splitters little kit off of Amazon I believe these are like 20 bucks too and a ball peen hammer so let's go step by step on how you do this so guys I'm going to show you this is the rain gutter on my 68 Camaro so first thing you want to do is find these spot welds and on this it's an unpainted area of the car if it's painted you probably want to take a um, a grinder or something get that down and you can find those dimples a little easier but this is pretty easy to see um, on that spot weld cutter you look at it a little closer this has got it's got cutters on both sides so you can turn this over and use both sides so it gives you twice the life but that's spring-loaded pin and when you go to put it here and you try to get it centered on your spot welds this thing wants to wander so what I found is if you can take uh, punch or a chisel just kind of center it on there this one's got a point center it on there smack it once it'll hold that pin because what i'm doing now is i'm taking this drill bit spot weld drill bit and i'm drilling out all these spot welds i can find and then i'm going to come back with the cutter because that puts a nice little dimple in there and this is really easy to get started you find your weld you just hold pressure And it'll get it started. Now I can come back with that cutter and I can drill those out. Very simple, very fast. Now I can come back with the cutter, I'll spring loaded in there, and I can start it right in the in that hole there. So about right there you want to stop and I'll drill all these out. And then we'll come back with our splitters and we'll show you how that works. As you can see on that time lapse, I know it was in fast forward, but this literally took me about 10 minutes to get all these out. So I'm going to use my straight bar here. And I'm going to just kind of edit this in and lightly tap it. And see, it's already breaking those pot wheels. That's it guys, so very simple, a few simple tools, 20 bucks for those cutters and another 20 for all these splitters. And you know, use your hammer that you got around your shop, but that'll pop these right off and make a simple job out of it. 